Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, we are going to be doing my TJ Maxx Shop With Me series where every single Sunday I post a new TJ Maxx video where I go to TJ Maxx and Marshalls and see all the new makeup for the week because every week there's always new things. It always blows my mind like how much new stuff they get in. So I film these every single Sunday. If you are new here, go ahead and subscribe so you don't miss out because you want to see these amazing deals. It seems like the stores are really starting to pick up, especially for the holidays. I remember last holiday they just got in so much makeup. It's like the best time to TJ Maxx shop. Um, my stores were a little bit slower in the beginning of the week, so I showed a lot of like skincare and body care. Not as much makeup, but then like Saturday I found quite a bit of new makeup so I feel like next week is gonna be a really good um, I'm definitely seeing some really cool things on Instagram that I'm gonna be like saving for like some NAR stuff Mac all the good stuff is gonna be coming so I'm very excited but let's go ahead and get to shopping So we will start off this week's video with these really cute Hello Kitty lashes. We've seen a few of these in the past, but this one I haven't seen with like the little unicorn horn on it. But these are called the Magical Flare Lashes. They just look really light and wispy, very gorgeous. And these are going for $5.99 for this pair. So we found one of these elf highlighters last week and now they have a new color. So this one is kind of a more medium to deeper shade. This is called golden highlight I think the other one was like a pearl color which I tried to find that again I can't find it because I wanted to pick it up because a lot of you guys said that it was really good but it's only $2.99 and it's described as um, cloud like texture which sounds so cool so there is more shades in these and they're such a good price too and here is even one more shade that's called taupe in that glow highlight from elf I'll also be sucking on these Sigma brushes. I just see this one so far. They're baking and strobing brush set, which in this one you get the F06 powder sweep, the F42 strobing fan brush, a F79 concealer kabuki, the F89 baked kabuki, and the F89 baked precision. So you get quite a few different brushes in there for $39.99, which I love Sigma's brushes. They're so good. This is really cool too, a little set from Real Techniques that has these fun brushes in it. We've been seeing those last week in like the single form, but they actually have a set called Ruler of the Skies Buff Blend and Spotlight set for $14.99 and it looks like you get three brushes and a little sponge, which is so pretty. So these are the brushes. You get a powder brush, a blend brush, eye perfecting, and then the cosmic sponge, which is like a little circle, which is super cool. Speaking of that, I just found this as well, the Brush Crush Cosmic Sponge Duo, so you get a little small one and a big one. This is so funny. Ugh, I don't know how these little sponges work, but this is going for $4.99. It kind of reminds me of like a little bouncy ball. Another Real Techniques little set. This is the Grab and Glow, so a little travel um, of their Brush Crush line. For $4.99, you get a mini expert face brush and a mini contour brush. It says Party Nights in Neon Lights. Super cute. Something from Foreo, which they make the little Foreo Luna cleanser devices, but they also have this, which must be in collaboration with Marvis Toothpaste. It's their Meant to Be a set, which has a hybrid sonic toothbrush. This is a crazy expensive look. How much that used to be at $169? Oh my gosh. You also get three Marvis Toothpaste flavors and a Marvis mouthwash, which the Marvis Toothpaste is like, I think. They are based in France because I remember they had a ton of them when I went to Paris. But yeah, that's what you get inside. And this is going for $39.99. So a significant discount compared to the $169. That's like insane. Here's a little set from the Body Shop, which they have this little hand cream set. It's called the Expert Hand Care Collection. You get two of their hemp hand creams, one almond and one of the absinthe one. I love their almond one. So this is going for $14.99, and I believe they are like full sizes. This is so cute from Philosophy. You get a little hot cocoa shower gel plus a mug. That is adorable. So this is the hot cocoa shower gel. This set is going for $14.99. They have the cutest holiday stuff. 
and a lot of you guys have been talking about Korea stuff that you can't find it but they are adding some new stuff because I haven't seen this yet this is the red berries multi-action body souffle which is going for $6.99 and then I have a shower gel I know so many of you guys love their shower gels and this one is the Japanese rose for $5.99 how amazing does this sound? The pink marshmallow buttercream. Oh my gosh. Their shower gels just sound so good. I don't usually get them here. They're always $11.99. But I think during Black Friday, Ulta has them on sale pretty much every year for like $9, I think. But I don't know. They're just kind of pricey compared to like what I use, which is Bath & Body Works. Um, during the semi-annual sale, I always stock up for like $2 shower gels. So I just feel like these are so expensive, even though they have such good scents, like the pink marshmallow buttercream. Oh look there's a candy cane one as well then they have spiced eggnog too so they have like all their holiday line here I'm loving all these philosophy sets they have this one's called the wrapped in vanilla we found a couple big holiday sets last week originally $28 here for $14.99 and you get a vanilla velvet truffle shower gel lotion and then the hot cocoa shower gel and lotion so I guess Kendall and Kylie have a fashion line because it's at TJ Maxx here but at least this one is it says Kendall and Kylie with this cute little cropped sweater very nice it's very soft but this is like the only thing I see from them for $16.99 all right so I just found this which I've been looking for the Too Faced Better Than Sex and Diamonds mascara of course, we've seen um, the Better Than Love here in the regular and waterproof version, but this one has the special glittery silver packaging from, I think it's from the Pretty Rich collection. So this is going for $12.99. It's just so gorgeous. So I'm super excited to see that here. I only see one so far, but they do have the other ones as well, which is literally the same thing. Then I found this pretty large Marc Jacobs set. It's called Somewhere Anywhere Spring 2018 Runway Edition. So this is from last spring. And in here you get three different lip colors. This is their liquid lip in a stick it's called. 16 hour luxe long wear. For $29.99 you get the makeup bag and then three of these colors. It looks like there's a red, a pink, and then like an orange shade. I just found this from Bare Minerals at Marshalls. It's kind of buried like in the very bottom. But this is the Complexion Rescue Hydrating Foundation Stick. I feel like this is fairly new from them. I have not tried it. Going for $7.99 in the shade Opal. I feel like this is their lightest shade. Let's see if anyone has swatched this or if it would be good because I'm kind of curious about trying it. I did check and it seems to be brand new. So, hmm, I might actually consider picking this up. It says it's a water-based liquid foundation in a stick with hydrating skincare benefits, SPF, and gives a medium coverage. So it actually sounds pretty cool, so I might grab this and maybe we can test it out. Then they also have these concealers in from Bare Minerals as well. They're full coverage concealer. I think we've seen these before. And they are going for $5.99 each. We have light neutral and light medium neutral here. Looks like they're also bringing in a bunch of the original powder foundations for $7.99. We have Fair 01. This one is Light 08. So here's the other Erica Jane and Too Faced lip kit that we did not find last week, but this is the one I own called the Polite Lips. This one is very pretty, going for $10.99. And this one I would definitely recommend. It's a more neutral set, so you get like a light pink lip liner and then this peachy pink gloss. Then they have a ton of different OPI nail polish sets here. So they have a bunch of these from the Nutcracker movie. This is little four little minis in here from last holiday. You get like a silver glitter, a blue, light blue, dark blue, and then a gold. And this set is for $5.99. Then they also have this like glitter set called Metamorphosis. And these are all just really pretty glitters. This is what they kind of look like on the back. Oh my gosh, look at this little baby brush set at Marshalls. It's also from Real Techniques. These are so tiny. They're adorable though. It looks like a little um, Christmas ornament with a tie on it. So this is a mini eye duo for $2.99. It says too many eye brushes to shade and blend with powder or cream eyeshadows for on the go. That is adorable. This looks new from Bosha. Their charcoal pour pudding. Intensive wash off treatment. I feel like... 
This used to be popular a couple years ago. If I'm thinking of the right thing, I'm gonna have to check. But this is going for $9.99. This is what I thought it was. I remember getting this as a sample from Sephora and I really liked it. So that is so cool that it's here at TJ Maxx Ian for only $10. That's an amazing price. Here's another Physicians Formula Butter Highlight in this really pretty pearl shade. It's actually called Pearl. <laughs> These are really fun. They're like nice and creamy, almost bouncy feeling. And this is going for $3.99. Looks like they're also restocking this foundation from Laura Mercier, the Candle Glow Soft Luminous Foundation from them in the shade of Vanilla. This one is only $14.99, which is a great deal. I feel like some of you guys said you like this one. I have their, I think it's like this Lumiere one that they have online at Sephora right now, which I really like. Um, also a bunch of Bare Pro powders. We saw like one of these last week, but it seems like this week there's a lot of Bare Minerals and quite a few Laura Mercier things. So we have um, this, which is $7.99, and we have the shades Porcelain, Fair, I think that's it, Porcelain and Fair for that powder. And then we have this from Glam Glow. This is their Pout Mud Fizzy Lip exfoliating treatment for $14.99. So just a little lip exfoliator from them. This packaging is such a bright color, I love it. A couple of lipsticks from the brand Clarence, I guess just one shade, but they had two of them. And this is called the Jolly Rouge Brilliant. It says Hydration, Brilliance, Moisturizing, Perfect Shine, Sheer Lipstick in the shade Soft Berry. This is for $14.99. This is cool too because I saw these in the New York stores and I never saw them here in Iowa but we have the Glam Glow Gravity Mud My Little Pony Mask which these are really fun. They're like a black glitter base and they're super pretty going for $29.99. dollars couple new skincare items. First up from Eve Loam. This is their moisture cream it says going for $29.99 they have really good skincare that's very pricey they also have this from Lancome the energy deve line which is always what I see here as you can see they have some more there but this is the antioxidant overnight recovery sleeping mask which is for $39.99 here so I noticed they're restocking quite a few of the bare mineral stuff this week they have a bunch of the bare minerals matte foundations I think I saw some of these at Marshalls. They are going for $7.99. And we have the shade Fairly Light 03. This one is Medium 10. This one is Fair 01. Medium Beige 12. And I think that's all the colors in the matte version. I also noticed they had this as well, which I think... I think we've seen this here before, the Bare Pro Foundation. This is one of my favorite foundations, actually, and it's really good if you guys want a nice, like, full coverage foundation from Bare Minerals. It is 24-hour performance wear liquid foundation with SPF 20. This is in the shade Ivory 02, going for $9.99. Really recommend this one if you guys are looking for a new foundation. Just saw these, which are so adorable. It's actually by Dry Bar, and it says Bun Day Besties. <laughs> so cute! Look how fun this is. For the bun before the blowout, um, you get three little hair ties for $3.99. I love these kind because they don't create a crease and they're really nice on your hair. But yeah, I thought that was really cute. Well, they had this NARS highlighting powder. We've seen a few of these in the past, and I can't remember if we've seen it this exact shade. It's in the shade St. Bart's, going for only $6.99, which seems really cheap for some reason. I don't know if that's priced wrong, but that's really good if it is. So I will show you guys what this one looks like. So this is the color St. Bart's, and it is a deeper toned highlighter. They have a few different other colors in this collection from NARS. We also found a new duo eyeshadow. These are going for $7.99. This one is in the shade Underworld. And then this one looks like this. It has kind of a light silvery blue and then a darker blue shimmer. We also found a couple new items from Laura Mercier, which is very exciting. This is the Caviar Chrome Veil Lightweight Liquid Eye Color. I have one of these. I still need to try it. I just got it, I think, a couple weeks ago from them in the mail, and they look really fun. I'll show you guys what these look like. Um, it's going for $7.99. This one is in the shade Moonlight Shimmer, which is absolutely stunning. I have a, like a gold one, but I like that this one's kind of like... A more cool toned shimmery champagne color. It's very gorgeous. I'm actually very tempted to get this one. And I just realized that my other one says $7.99, but this one says $5.99, which I'm not sure why. It's very weird. I might see if they can 
maybe a price adjusted it we'll see this one is the shade gilded fresco which is like this really light rose gold these are very gorgeous I hope that this one's the right price instead of the seven because I might pick one up in that case also found a caviar stick eye color in the shade metallic taupe Ooh, I actually might get this I don't know there's so many good things here and they're in good shades this one is like a more long-lasting eye crayon going for $5.99. These are just kind of nice to throw on the lids and go and have a really pretty sparkly lid shade. So this is the color. They also have a new Velour Extreme Matte Lipstick. This one is in the shade Fresh going for $5.99. We saw a couple of these when we went to the New York City stores. They had quite a few different ones. Um, but this is the only one I see here today. So this is what the color looks like. It looks like a nice rose shade. And this is a like crayon lipstick. Okay, how cute is this? This little max set that comes with four, I think, mini lipsticks. I love the packaging though, how it's in like this little plastic case. Um, it's $19.99, kind of pricey for little minis, but this is from their last holiday from the Shiny Pretty Things collection. Uh, looks like you get two matte lipsticks and then one of their cream sheens and a satin lipstick. I'm trying to see the shades. I don't know if it says. Fam only, nutmegged, hark, and then half calf, which I think these are all um, limited edition shades. So I thought that was super cute. I really want it, but I'm like, I don't know. For that price, it seems kind of high. So what do you guys think? Let me know. I just love finding these here, the Laneige Lip Slipping Mask in Berry for $12.99. I always see it come in and out of the stores, like every so often, so it's just very random when I spot it, but love this stuff. Also restocking on some First Aid Beauty stuff this week for skincare. Um, they have this again, the Ultra Repair Cream uh, Cucumber and Melon. I don't know if we've seen this one. We've seen like a vanilla one, and then there was another scent, but this is like... You get so much product in here. This would be nice to use like on the body for ultra hydration. And this is going for $19.99. It does have the expiration though, um, December of 2020. So you'd have like a year to use this basically, which is plenty of time. Okay, this brush from NYX is gorgeous. It has like, I don't even know. It looks like a donut, but like a cat donut with evil eyes on the bottom. I don't even know. <laughs> but it's so cute though. Let's see, maybe it's an owl. Weird. Okay, so this is the Paradise Fluff collection. For $4.99, you get this face brush. Let me know what animal is this. <laughs> they have a ton of these today. The MAC Bullet and Bad Lash. I picked this up a couple weeks ago. I need to try that out for you guys still. Um, this is going for $12.99, so it looks like they're getting in a couple of new MAC items. And then I'm pretty sure this is a new lipstick shade from Anastasia that we haven't seen here yet. It is in the shade Plumeria. It looks really fun. And this one is $7.99 for their matte lipsticks. They're getting in a ton of new brushes and sponges for the holidays. I noticed this from the e.l.f. Active line. This is their blend out silicone sponges. I tried one of these before and I absolutely did not like the whole like silicone thing. I don't know, I just didn't blend my foundation very well. But these are $2.99 if you guys do like them. And then they're also getting in more holiday sets like brushes and stuff like that. They always have tons. Um, they have some of these, a set of 10 by the brand Polish Beauty Supply. We have a couple of those. These are $19.99 each. So this one is the Artist Limit Brush Collection and they have the Enchanted Brush Collection as well. All right, so since it is officially November, TJ Maxx is kind of in like holiday mode. So around this time, they usually have tons and tons of beauty products and I noticed they are restocking a lot of stuff. So if there's stuff in the past that you haven't been able to find, now is the time to look because I've noticed a lot of things popping up again. Um, I did want to point out they have this sketch marker from Too Faced in the shade Deep Espresso. This one is $4.99. And then this set is new from Anastasia. This is their liquid lipstick set with three little minis. They're not really like super small. They're actually a pretty good size. And let's see, you get the shade Days, Bittersweet, and then the shade Hudson. This set is for $12.99. And then I saw this, which is like, whoa, because this came out like so long ago. Like this, I don't know, this has to be old. I don't know if Too Faced still makes this, but they are bringing back some Too Faced stuff. I saw someone find like the 
I don't know, something cutie palette. And now I saw this, the Soulmates Blushing Bronzer. Um, they have the Ross and Rachel, and then there is another one with Carrie and Big from Sex and the City. This is Ross and Rachel from a friend. So I guess they're bringing back some old school Too Faced products here. Um, this is going for $9.99. Let me know what your thoughts on this down below that Too Faced is bringing some like older products in because these have to have been made a while ago. This is also a restock but it looks like they're bringing back these Bare Minerals Gen Nude palettes. I see the shade Copper here. Um, it's the only one I see though. Um, this came out I feel like about a year ago at TJ Maxx. Um, this is going for $9.99. These are really good quality eyeshadows. Some new NAR stuff is starting to trickle in as well. It seems like my TJ Maxx is just getting them now, but this is the Power Matte Lip Pigment in the shade Call Me for $7.99. This is what it looks like. I feel like this is probably one of their liquid lipstick formulas. I have not tried these from NARS, but I feel like they're fairly new. I've seen a lot of newer NARS stuff um, looking on Instagram at people's finds. Uh, it seems like there's some pretty good stuff coming. They have their little stocking card out this morning, but like I was saying earlier, there is a ton of Bare Minerals this week. I found more of that foundation stick. I already picked one up, but this one's in Natural 05. I'm pretty sure I picked up the lightest shade, so we'll see how that one works. I don't need to buy another one. Um, let's see what else. They have the Bare Skin Complete Coverage Serum Concealer. I don't know, have we seen this here before? I feel like we've seen it in darker shades, but never like all of these. I used to love this stuff. It's a very nice like hydrating concealer. This is going for $6.99 and they have the shade Fair. And here is Medium. But yeah, I definitely recommend picking this up if you guys want something more hydrating underneath the eyes. And then as you can see, there's like a bunch of their powder foundations in there. I just realized the Bare Minerals foundations have the expiration on them, which is 2021. So that's pretty good. These are fairly new and will last a while. I don't know why they're here. It's so weird. This just came out this year. I almost overlooked the Stila because it had the same packaging as uh, the glitters. Oh, that's new too. But um, they have some new Stila sets from the holidays. I think this came out last year. This is the huge little duo for $12.99. It looks like you get in here. A full size mascara. Um, this is their huge extreme lash mascara. This stuff is really good. Would definitely recommend it. It makes your lashes look amazing. And then you also get a full size of their smudge stick waterproof eyeliner and stingray. Oh my goodness, those are my favorite shades. And then I see something else here. We have a new liquid lip set. This is the Stay All Day Liquid Lipstick Set for $9.99 with three minis. And this one is in My Bear Lady. The shades you get are Patina, Illuminaire Shimmer, and Nudo Shimmer. I haven't heard of the last two, but Patina is one of their best sellers. Such a good little set. There's a random find from Soap and Glory, actually. It says Brow Almighty Power Glide Crayon. So a little brow crayon. I don't know how I feel about this. <laughs> it kind of has like a thicker tip on it. Um, in the shade Dark Days, going for $4.99. I think that's the only one they have. It's so nice when I can catch Marshalls with their stocking cart out because otherwise it's just a disaster of opened, messed up makeup. <laughs> I'm on the hunt today for the MAC Aladdin collection, but... I have a feeling we won't find it for a while, but some people are starting to find it on Instagram, the highlighter, so I'm really looking hard to see if it's here. Whoa, you guys, I was not expecting to find this. This is from MAC, it's one of their mineralized blushes in Warm Soul. Does anyone remember? Casey Holmes used to absolutely rave about this blush back in the day, and I never bought it, because I just like, oh, that color probably won't work for me, but now I'm like, Wow, okay, maybe I need it. It is, ooh, yikes, okay, 1999. Not, not worth it for that price. It is beautiful though, but usually I feel like their blushes are like 12 dollars maybe $14.99, but 19 that's a little much. So sad, because I really want this. <laughs> More Bay Minerals Foundations, the Bay Approach I talked about that I love in Fair 01. And then they also have a bunch of their Complexion Rescue uh, tinted, I would call it like a tinted foundation or a tinted moisturizer almost. It's very light coverage. Um, these are $7.99 in the shade Vanilla 02. And this one is... Oh wait, I just got this in my advent calendar. This is the Complexion Rescue Defense. So this is a 
SPF basically so that's really interesting that this is here this one is $9.99 that's what the packaging looks like on this so not the foundation but the SPF I was worried this week was gonna be kind of crappy but it's turning out to be pretty good so far we found good stuff from Bare Minerals and Stila and a couple matte goodies you know Bare Minerals they also have um, this eye cream from them as well the brilliant future age defense and renew eye cream this is for $9.99 and it is a full size. Also some new Bosha masks in. This is the Subaki Oil Deep Hydrating Mask for $3.99 for a single use. They also have this Sake Brightening Mask, this uh, Sake Brightening Eye Mask for $3.99, and this one comes with three of them. We also have a Charcoal Spot Corrector. That's interesting, I haven't heard of this before. Um, for $7.99, expiration date is on it. Yeah, it's supposed to minimize the appearance of blemishes without over drying or irritating the skin. That sounds nice. And then they also have the pore purifying black strips, which I think is just like a no strip, kind of like the Biore ones. Um, this is, if you can see, $5.99. You also have their luminizing black mask, which is kind of fun. It's a peel off mask, and it literally looks like this on the face. And this one is for $12.99. All right, guys, welcome back from me. And my cat living his best life over there <laughs> anyways i'm gonna show you guys what i bought at tj maxx this week i didn't go too crazy there's definitely some other stuff i wanted to buy but i'm trying not to spend as much because there's a lot of stuff like tj maxx makeup i bought that i need to use for my testing videos because i have not uploaded them and there's just been so many things I had to get up and the TJ Maxx ones kind of got pushed to the back. So I hope I can do one this week because I need to catch up on stuff. But I did get four things this week and I see that there's some really cool stuff that's coming. So I'm going to try and save for that because I don't want to go too crazy. So first of all, I picked up a couple Laura Mercier items. I'm so excited to see these here because these are actually like really good products that are actually in very wearable shades. By turbo <laughs> so first I picked up one of their caviar chrome veils now this one I just love the color I had to have it it's in the shade moonlight shimmer and for some reason this one was priced wrong I think it's supposed to be $5.99 because there was another one that was $5.99 but she wouldn't adjust it so I just went ahead and bought it anyway because I really love this shade it is beautiful and I have so many like gold and rose gold shades so I just I decided to spend the extra two dollars and go ahead and grab this because it's just so pretty it's not like your typical gold shade it has like a more coolness to it which I really like so I'm excited to test these out they're just a fun like liquid shimmer and then we also found the caviar eye sticks which these are like best sellers from Laura Mercier um, this one's in the shade metallic taupe which was $5.99 and this one kind of reminds me more of a like rose gold even though it's called taupe I don't know I would call it like rose gold in my opinion okay next I did pick up the bare minerals complexion rescue foundation the stick version I was so excited to find this because I've been wanting to try this and this is like a brand new product and it's already at TJ Maxx that is just so crazy to me uh, I'm not sure about the shade this is opal 01 I think it's like the lightest but it looks like it might be able to work for me I'm pretty fair right now sometimes I do self tan it feels nice and like hydrating so yeah, it kind of blends in. It has this opal one has more of a pinky undertone, which is perfect because I have more pink undertones and that pretty much blended right into my hand. So I think that one will work. That one was $7.99, such a good deal. And then I did get a pair of shoes. I have been wearing a lot more just like athleisure clothing and like sneakers and stuff like that so i did grab this pair of shoes that were on sale um these are so cute they're little slip-ons and i love that it's kind of like a snake print with like shiny sequin on it it's so pretty and these were amazingly comfortable i wore them yesterday and they did not hurt my feet at all which is hard to find with some of these kind of sneakers but these were i don't know they were very random i'm pretty sure someone returned them because they had a weird tag and it's by the brand coconuts by mm, Mart Matisse I think which I looked that up and I guess they are pretty pricey like $70 shoes and I got them for $19.99 so I was pretty pleased with that I did notice though they do kind of crease right here which is kind of annoying but these are just so comfy and I'm I don't regret buying those at all so I'm trying to buy more just casual shoes for like fall and winter 
So that's pretty much everything I bought at TJ Maxx and Marshalls this week. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you guys found anything exciting down below. I think what I'm really trying to find next week is the MAC Aladdin collection. And also I really want to find the NARS holiday items. Because a lot of people have been finding some NARS palettes and from last holiday. Which is really cool. So thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll talk to you guys later. Bye guys.